fundamental research is really important for our future because it makes the inventions that make ultimately the technology possible. Think about your smartphones. If we had not worked on fundamental research on new materials to make liquid crystal displays, we would not have smartphones. We would not have a flat screen in your home. Think about the airplane. When the Wright brothers in 1903 were flying in a very primitive machine for the first time, nobody had realized that a hundred years later we would have an Airbus or a Boeing 747. We look at Mother Nature, we learn from it, and then we build a completely synthetic machine, a Boeing 747. And nobody would have predicted when you saw this very primitive machine of the Wright brothers. This takes a long time. We have to do discoveries that make the materials, the new inventions, possible for 30 years from now. Yeah, the future of molecular machines lies in smart materials, smart drugs, uh, all kinds of applications where we use dynamic functions. So think about the first motors many years ago, centuries ago, the first steam engine, the first electric motor, that made it possible that we have now all our machines that we use, the cars, the planes, we can propel the machines in our factories. But also think about our body. The human body is full of machines that makes it possible that we can walk, that we can see, that our cells divide. So with these molecular machines, now the stage is set to build real materials that can adapt properties. We can maybe make tiny robots. This is the future.